My name is Kathy Elizabeth Hamilton West Phillips, mostly called Sue. When I was a little girl, we lived at the crossroads in Hamlet, the Batley Dairy Road and Airport Road there on the corner. Well, on the other corner was Boy Jacobs and his wife, and they had like 12 children, and they all lived in the neighborhood. Well, my roof was one of their oldest daughters. She had five daughters, her and Bobby Green. Before Carol went into the military, my sister, Carol would often help Myra Ruth with her laundry and stuff. Myra Ruth and my mama were best of friends. And mama didn't have many friends back then, but she was one of her closest. Well, we were up there and it was really late at night. I remember it was after midnight, but it was okay because I was with Carol. And I saw on the airport road, before you get to Hatcher Road, they were in a triangle. My roof, it was shaped like a triangle from Airport Road, Valley Dairy Road, all the way down to uh, outside furniture. Hatcher Road, which that would have been Valley Dairy Road meeting with Hatcher Road and Airport, which is a total triangle. Well, that night, I saw as a little girl, I, I saw something shaped as, as, as they say, aliens. It was round like a saucer. I remember it had many little round red lights going around in a circle like a saucer would. It was even shaped like the toys we used to get for Christmas where you would spin them around. And I saw little people, little Martian like, like they show today. I literally saw them. Well, it just wasn't me. My Ruth is probably about 84 years old. She lives on the airport road. Her last name is My Ruth Green. But when My Ruth's niece died, which was Sonia Cole, which was my best friend Sharon's sister-in-law, daughter, 10 years ago, My Ruth was at Sharon's and I was there and I asked my roof in front of her whole family At that time in front of everybody I said now tell me You saw it too. I remember and My roof is a very holy woman my roof saw it. She saw the the spaceship. She saw the aliens Well ten years ago also for ain't many died ain't many was over here and she told me she was in the car with Max alone, and they were coming down the Batley Dairy Road and getting there at the airport road where that's where we had lived on that corner for years when I originally saw the others. Aunt Minnie said she saw the Martians. Well, the little people. She said my, Max alone didn't, but she did. Well, I believe my Aunt Minnie because I seen them. Well, a few years ago, my roof was over here at Mama's house when Harry died. Well, before Harry died, she had brought him a pair of brown tennis shoes because my roof loved Harry, and she brought him over here four years ago. And my roof was sitting in here with a crowd of other people when she brought Harry his shoes. And I asked her at that time again to tell everybody who thought I was crazy what we seen, and she said, "Yes, we saw the spaceship." We saw the Martian people. My roof is still living today, and she lives on in the same house on the airport road, and her name is Myra Ruth Jacobs Green, with an E on the end. Ah, uh, but I did see it, and within a week, there was a huge fire. The military, the National Guard had been brought in. We, were, we had a pump in our backyard. We pumped water and carried buckets of water because in this triangle there that my roof lived in because right up above our house was where Hatcher Road began but it, it went as a triangle so the whole area that burned was in a triangle and we were all getting buckets of water pumping it to throw in, in neighbors yards which was all her people but the military was brought in 
everything. They let that whole place burn. We were the ones trying to save our neighbors' homes. They were not even concerned. And I was a little girl. They weren't concerned about everybody's house that was going to burn down. It was almost as if they burned it theirself. And they probably did. But I do remember it was in the 60s before my sister went into the military. And it can be verified today. My Ruth Green is still alive. Uh, and myself. Thank you.